The big problem that we are solving is uh, how to prevent congestions, how to make our roads safer, how to make the, the risk factor of, of our junctions you know, lower. Um, this, is, this is why we all know that we need more precise data. We need them faster, we need them in a higher resolution so that this system that can react can have actually everything possible to react upon. So uh, this is what we, why we, we, we created Good Vision Live Traffic. Uh, Good Vision Live Traffic is a software product. It is a software that you can uh, that you deploy to your smart roadside units or to your uh, edge computer, to your uh, compatible camera or to your server. And uh, you can uh, process uh, live camera streams in real time, on the fly, and extract the data, detect various uh, events, violations, and so on, and use this data for many purposes, for traffic control, you know, uh, triggering uh, controllers, uh, for uh, uh, situation of awareness to, to, let's say, some connected vehicle uh, network, and, and so on. There are basically two main use cases that this product is doing, two main functions, I would say. The first function is the real-time detection of the traffic events, of what is happening under the camera. The second one is the ability to continuously and permanently collect the data. A good vision live traffic is providing you with a just-in-time insight or just-in-time data that your system can act upon. We are detecting uh, every traffic attendant on the scene and, and the algorithm is classifying it into one of the eight traffic class uh, categories, including pedestrians and bicycles, uh, but we also provide the customizations, uh, so custom schemes are also possible. So it, all, it operates in the multimodal uh, conditions every time, day or night, uh, any weather, uh, it's geographically independent, so it, it incorporates the same level of AI that is uh, that you can find in uh, Good Vision Video Insights cloud processing. The video is processed inside the device, so if the device is on site, the video will never leave the site. The device itself doesn't store the video, it just extracts the anonymous data uh, about the traffic behavior or, or, or about the every traffic attendant behavior and it is used for you know, calculating those uh, traffic parameters that, that you're looking for.